on days like these, the Dutch delight in showing off their liberal legacy. 75 floats parading through the capital's canals. Famous footballers use their profiles to promote the ideas of tolerance and understanding. I think it's, it's maybe a good thing if there is a very good player, you know, one of the best in the world, that comes out and says to the whole world that he's gay, because I think that will definitely help uh, the acceptation of it. Russia and the Netherlands have strong political and trade links, but a recent law banning gay propaganda, combined with the expulsion of four gay rights activists from Russia last month, have turned President Vladimir Putin into an unpopular figure in these colorful waters. The Eurogroup president and Dutch finance minister Jerome Dijsselbloem joined the boat parade. From somewhere in the thronging waters, he told one local newspaper that gay rights in Russia were heading in the wrong direction. In 2001, the Netherlands was the first country in the world to legalize gay marriage. Today, these crowds are hoping to inspire others to follow their moves. Anna Holligan, BBC News.